In this video, we're going to take a look at a Jetpack module called Subscribe. Subscribe allows people to subscribe to your blog via email so that when you post, they get your post in their email. And they may want this for two reasons. They may want to simply read it in their email, or maybe they simply want to be notified when you've posted so they can go to your blog. There are several options available, and we'll take a look at each of them. We'll click Activate. and then configure. Here are some options. You can show a follow blog option on the comment form and you can show a follow comments option on the comment form. So first let's take a look at a post and we'll view it. And here we have those two options. Notify me of follow up comments by email and notify me of new posts by email. Now if you want to edit what people see in their emails, we can go to the reading settings. And here is the text that people will get when they subscribe. In order to help you prevent spam, the end user must approve this email. So they can't just be signed up by their ex-girlfriend or something like that. Now there's another way to subscribe. If we go to Appearance, Widgets, here at the top is Blog Subscriptions. Let's put it right at the top of my sidebar. And then the default title is Subscribe to Blog via Email. And then there's some optional text here, a Subscribe Placeholder, and a Subscribe Button, and a Success Message. And you can optionally show the total number of subscribers. Let's go take a look at that. Right here we have our subscribe widget. So let's put in an address and subscribe. And it says, success, an email was just sent to confirm your subscription. As I mentioned at the beginning of this video, there are a variety of reasons why someone would want to do this. Personally, I would not want to follow a blog via email. However, I would enjoy being told when there is a post. I had a friend once whose blog I loved, but it was behind a password, and so the RSS feed wasn't even available. So there was no way for me to know when a new post was made. So she put the subscribe option on it. I subscribed, and I got an email every time she posted. And then I went to her blog, and I logged in. This can be an excellent tool for your readers, but if it's not used, then I don't recommend installing it. Obviously, you can't know until you've installed it and tried to use it for a little while. But if you have it for a while and no one seems to be using it, my recommendation is to turn it off. It's just one extra gadget to confuse people on your site, and if they're not going to use it, you shouldn't you probably shouldn't have it there on the other hand if you put it on and people subscribe like crazy then by all means use it with gusto